Hi there, welcome to the Happy Chicken Coop YouTube channel. Thanks for joining me today. We're gonna be talking about black chicken eggs. Before I get into that, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also be sure to subscribe to our website, thehappychickencoop.com. If you subscribe using the link in the description below, you'll receive a free ebook about the 10 best egg laying chicken breed. All right, without further ado, let's get into it. So you may have seen beautiful black chicken eggs circulating alongside a strikingly gorgeous all black chicken and wondered where can I get one? Ebony colored chicken eggs in your basket on your social media feed. And of course, as a hard boiled egg on the counter are the things chicken lovers dream about. Well, I hate to burst your bubble, but that's all they are, just dreams. Black chicken eggs are not a thing unless you color them that way which is often what we've actually seen circulating on social media. But that being said, there's a reason this rumor got started. Even though the eggs aren't black, the birds are, and they're just as impressive as those fake black chicken eggs. So let's talk about the first breed that is jet black. The I am Samani. As unbelievable as the photos of all black chicken may be, they're actually the real deal. The I am Samani is pigmented in every which way imaginable. While there's sheens and hints of blue on the I am Samani's feathers, it's truly a sight to behold and most people are willing to pay a pretty penny for this breed. In fact, most of these chickens used to sell for no less than $50 a chick. As you can imagine, breeders and fanciers have found a pretty interesting niche but as far as their eggs go, their eggs are actually cream in color. And this bird is actually the reason for black chicken eggs. And it makes sense if everything else, including the tongue of this chicken is black, then its egg should emerge black as well, right? Unfortunately, one can only imagine a new I am Samani's owner's disappointment awaiting the first black egg only to find a cream colored egg in its place. So as with all things, research your breeds carefully to avoid disappointment when your hens start laying their first eggs. But let's talk about the genetics behind the black chicken. Black chicken eggs or not, the I'm Samani is a sight to behold. No other chicken is as pigmented in, in as many places as this beautiful bird. National Geographic dug into the black chicken egg puzzle to uncover the truth about the pitch black chicken and the reason for their coloration. Here's what they learned. And I quote, most vertebrates have a gene known as endothelin 3 or EDN3, which among other things controls skin color. And when a normal chicken is developing certain cells like those in the skin and feather follicles express EDN3, which triggers the migration of melanoblasts or the cells that go on to create color. It's a lot to take in for those of us who aren't interested in genetics. Still, it's a helpful explanation for those who go gaga over the science of the situation. There are other black chicken breeds available. While the I am Samani is one of the first black chicken breeds that comes to mind, the Jersey Giant also has a gorgeous black sheen, as does the black Australor. But again, neither of these breeds lay black chicken eggs, nor do they have the same through and through black pigmentation of combs, wattles, or bones. But there is another breed with some of the same pigmentation qualities as the I'm Samani, the Silky Chicken. The amazing thing about the Silky, by the way, is that it comes in a variety of colors and it's also a bantam. You can get this fluffy breed in black, white, blue, splash, and on and on. Point is, all the varieties have black skin. And even the white version of the Silky has beautiful black skin meat and bones some farmsteads have begun breeding and selling the silky to restaurants as a delicacy however even though the dressed silky's appearance and size are out of the ordinary the flavor isn't much different from any other chicken but that's not always the point sometimes it comes down to novelty now let's talk about some eggs that actually are black even though it's disappointing to learn that gorgeous i am samani's do not lay pitch black eggs. The good news is there are pigmented bird eggs in the world, they're just not produced by chickens. The first egg that is actually black are emu eggs. They lay a sizably large, nearly black egg. They're very dark in color, but maintain a greenish tint to them. Ever since people began realizing their I am Samanis weren't going to lay black chicken eggs, they became obsessed with other ways of getting black eggs. Emu eggs are sold at specialty food stores directly from the breeders for a whopping $30 plus per egg. This price makes sense because the emu only lays 25 eggs per year, so they're not abundantly available like the chicken egg. Another bird that lays black eggs is the Cayuga duck, sometimes. The Cayuga duck, another gorgeous black bird, can lay black eggs at the beginning of the season, but the eggs become white in color as time passes. The duck's genetics may also play an essential role in its ability to lay black eggs early in the season. Duck eggs are delicious and taste similar to chicken eggs as well. But on the bright side, there is actually a chicken breed that almost lays black chicken eggs. 
So you've got the non-existent black chicken egg, the emerald colored emu egg, and the sometimes black duck egg. But if strikingly dark colored eggs are on your must have list, we all have a chicken list like this, no judgment here, then you'll be happy to feast your peepers on the Moran models. While the eggs are not black, they are a beautiful chocolate color. And some of the varieties of this breed lay darker eggs than others. For example, the black copper Moran lays a deep chocolate colored egg with dark specks. So if you're looking to add the darkest egg possible to your Easter egg basket, you can't really go wrong with this egg layer. From there, the Moran varieties lays slightly less pigmented eggs. And of course, you can get to the lighter browns, which are more standard. And then you've got chickens that lay pinks, greens, blues, and traditional white eggs. If you don't go any of these routes, you can also always color your own eggs naturally. The black chicken eggs you've probably seen online are Photoshopped to look as black as they are. So if you love the look of those eggs, go ahead and craft your own. Activated charcoal is a natural way to color an egg black. Infuse activated charcoal in water and vinegar, and then soak the egg in the infusion for as long as you'd like to achieve the shade you're aiming for. Now let's talk about why the fascination with black chicken eggs. So what's the deal? I must admit, I was also disappointed when those deep black eggs turned out to be fake. Let's be honest, we like to think that we have something out of the ordinary, but if we can continually see the plain old white chicken egg, a black chicken egg is an exciting change. We wonder, does it feel, taste, smell different? And it was the same for the Easter egger, blue or blue green chicken eggs as well. When the blue laying chicken entered the scene and it was and still is an exciting addition to the egg basket. Gorgeous rainbows of egg shades are all the rage on social media. For example, the Instagram hosts some fantastic photographers who showcase their unique egg varieties and colors regularly. It's no wonder we want to try something different. So to summarize, always remember that not everything we see on the internet is the truth. So even though the emu egg is close to black and the Cayuga duck can lay a black egg every now and then, the result probably isn't the perfectly impressive black egg you saw on Facebook anyways. Eggs should be unique and imperfect because that's nature at work. And while there are breeders who dedicate their lives to breeding the perfect chicken that lays the perfect egg, we have to wonder if there's such a thing or ever can be without problems. So don't forget to enjoy the eggs your flock has laid for you that you have already. They're perfect and exciting in their own way. That's going to do it for us here at the Happy Chicken Coop. Thanks for listening. If you find our content interesting, if you learn something new, please be sure to like the video and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also, be sure to subscribe to our website, thehappychickencoop.com. With that, I hope you have a great day, and we'll talk to you soon.